absolutely oh, oh. terrifying. Here we go. <laughs> it was terrifying watching you go yeah. through that. What Adam didn't know is that as frightening as his experience was, it had oh. an astonishing real-world impact. Well, it was a typical day. It was right before Easter. And I got up and got Emily up and got her ready to go. I left about 4.30 in the morning. And I got about three miles down the road. And I hit a patch of slushy snow and went off and into the water. And I looked, and their car was filling up with water. It was so happening so fast. I crawled through the vehicle, got into the back seat with Emily, unstrapped her from her car seat, and I tried the driver's side door. That door wouldn't open. I had Emily in my arms trying to keep her out of the water, and uh, I'm going, oh my gosh. They need to get us out of here. And then, you know, the, the Mythbusters thing came to mind. And it was like, OK, I have to wait. Even though I didn't want to, I had to wait until the pressure equalized in the vehicle so I could get the door open. I waited until that moment pushed the door open, and it opened like nothing. And I kind of swam, walked, and I kind of held Emily above my head to keep her out of the water and got onto the road. I still get emotional. I still, every year on April 3rd, I still kind of go, yeah, this could have been the day me and her weren't here, you know? Wow. I, I, I don't know what to say to that. That's intense. We're not just blowing things up here, people. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>